I found out why they've called it the Women's River. Really? I found out that they used to teach the girls at the river mouth. Oh, really? What sort of lessons are they teaching? Just about life and how to be a woman. Also, when it flushes out, it's, it represents the cycle, the monthly cycle for women. Cool. That is a fun more than I do. Oh, but we've, we've had Have some you found anything? Oh, yeah, we've, we've got more information about the Ongapanga River. And we've got one of the reasons about the tribes. Really? What is it? Two tribes met. They'd usually battle. And what they did with the women is they hid them along the side of the Ongapanga River um, to protect them from other tribes. With all the research we have done, we have finally found out why the Ongapanga River is the women's river. We have found three reasons. Firstly, when the river flushes out, it represents the cycle of a woman's body. Secondly, when two tribes met, they would have a battle because they were interfering with each other's territory. But before they had the battle, they would hide the women at the river to keep them safe. Um, when girls were young, they got taught at the river mouth of the Yonkapunga River about life and being a woman. There's the river mouth where the Garda people used to teach the young girls. There's the answer. Another history mystery solved. Thank you for all your help. <laughs> hey, it's your rheumatoid, okay? Fine.